I first looked at making money yeah. and I was like, I understand you need the skill to make money. But then right. I looked at trading and I was like, it's just candles. It's just candles. <laughs> All right, let's just do it. Might as well. Let's go. So what I done is I, I done loads and loads of research. Um, it was hard to find out what the true source is. And I was looking at a young age, I was looking for like the, what do you call it? Like, like the golden strategy. Like yeah, the yeah, yeah, amazing yeah. thing. And, and it just doesn't exist. Yeah, the Holy Grail. The Holy Grail. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I couldn't find the Holy Grail, uh, but I found that out quite quickly. Yeah. And then I just started manual trading and I was getting better and I, all my metrics were good. I was really looking like at performance metrics. So I have quite yeah. an athletic background, right? Okay. And so well, what, how I was raised athletically, whatever sport you do, you want to track why you're good. Why are you actually good? You can't just go there with arrogance and be ego and like, oh yeah, well, I'm good because I can kick the ball and hit the crossbar or whatever. <laughs> it was, you have to track it properly and okay, if you do this this many times, you do it this on average per game, etc. So I did the same thing with trading okay. where I tracked pretty much everything, where and why and how I was taking trades. Mm -hmm. Did they execute well? Uh, and when I was following my plan, was it going well? Um, and then um, that ran really well. Uh, but then I got into uh, algorithmic trading and robots. And I was like, why, why am I trading manually when a robot can do everything I do manually? Yeah. So I was like, am I being lazy? Am I, is, that, is it a lazy <laughs> thing? Is it, it's easy, it's just a robot does it for me.